My name is Jonathan Dixon, Vice President of International Corporate Services at OTC Markets Group. Today, we're at the Experian PLC London office. Experian trade on the OTCQX best market under tickets EXPGY and EXPGF. Evelyn, thank you for joining us. Thanks very much, Jonathan, for inviting me. As a global leader in consumer credit reporting, how does Experian distinguish itself among others in this space? So we're a global information services company that operates in 44 countries. And whilst a large part of our business is the Consumer Credit Bureau reporting, we also have a decisioning business which specialises in software, scoring, analytics, identity and fraud and these kinds of solutions. And thirdly, we also have a consumer services business. And we're the only company in our sector that operates across all three of those spaces. So that allows us um, a unique opportunity to pull uh, innovative products together, use the capabilities of all three different parts of our business. So a great example of this is Experian Boost. So this is a product where our um, consumers can choose to provide data via our consumer portal, which uh, goes into the main credit bureau in our B2B part of our business and allows them to increase their score, um, providing them cheaper access to credit. And it's something we can only do because we have um, all three parts of those business. Can you talk about your ESG strategy and the company's initiatives surrounding improving financial health? So ESG is incredibly important at Experian. Um, it's core to everything we do. As the world's largest credit bureau, we have a unique opportunity to help millions of people around the world improve their financial health. Um, and we do this through three core ways. So one is through our core um, products, so like Boost that I just mentioned, but also through the general activities of our credit bureaus, um, innovative solutions like Lyft, which helps score more people and much more inclusive. Um, secondly, we also have a social innovation fund that allocates funding specifically to try and find innovative new ways of helping millions of people across the globe. And we're aiming to reach 100 million people with that by 2025. And lastly, we have a community investment program, uh, which has a number of initiatives like United for Financial Health, which is partnering with NGOs across the world uh, to help millions of people recover from the financial impacts of COVID. And we're help hoping to help uh, 100 million people with that by 2024. Experian joined the OTCQX market in 2010. How has cross-trading on OTCQX helped complement the company's IR strategy in the United States? So obviously the US is the largest financial market out there and our shareholder base are US investors. So making sure that we're providing that information to that market in a way that um, you know, suits them um, is very important. It also allows uh, many more people to be able to trade in our shares. And that's therefore over the last few years, whilst our strategy has been to expand our US shareholder base, um, having that uh, the support of the OTCQX uh, platform um, has been very helpful in supporting that uh, broader IR strategy. Evelyn, thank you for joining us. Pleasure, thank you very much.